the things Texas is known for, oil, barbecue, and high school football are all near the top of the list. Recently, I had a chance to cook up some good stock briskets for a high school tailgate with our friend Troy from Thanks for Eating. But this wasn't just any tailgate. This game was the home opener for Permian and Odessa. This high school was the setting and inspiration of Friday Night Lights, the book by Buzz Bissinger that inspired the film and television show about a small town in Texas and its love affair with high school football. The fervor surrounding the town and the team coincided with a rise to prominence on the field in the late 80s and 90s. Troy is from Odessa and attended Permian. He set up the event, got us field passes, and a tour of the school. He also coordinated the meat donation from Goodstock. Huge shout out to them for the amazing briskets. We started the long drive from Austin and stopped over in San Angelo for a beer at Plateau Brewing, and then we made our way to Odessa. The next morning, we checked out Brantley Creek Barbecue, which is a newer spot in Odessa. These guys started in a food trailer, I believe, and then moved to this nice, airy, kind of semi-indoor, outdoor, spacious place. They also landed themselves recently on the best new top 25 barbecue joints in Texas list from Texas Monthly. You know we're hitting it. We're doing the Friday Night Lights tailgate sponsored with Goodstock and Evan Leroy. We're doing a school tour, a pep rally, hitting up a barbecue spot, Brantley Barbecue right now. Yeah, we're super excited, handing out some free brisket. That's Celebrating it. football season, baby. Let's go. It's the kickoff to football season. It's the kickoff to busy season. Let's eat some barbecue. Let's watch some football. Let's go. We got there probably around 10.30. There might have been about five or six people in front of us. They have a nice smokehouse set up here with a couple 1,000 gallons in a big open pit room, which is really nice. Couldn't be more impressed with all the food and the service here. This place was really, really good. I have a pound and a half of first hit. Oh, pound and a half? Yes, please. Meat or fatty? Thanks. Can I have a rack of ribs? Yes. Half pound of turkey. A half chicken. Also gonna do a smash burger. Why do our sides with you too? Port of mac and cheese. Single beans. Single, yeah. Pint potato salad. Pint jalapeno corn. One OG BBQ pie. That's a Frito pie, right? Yeah. I'm also gonna do three Twinkies. Fritos. I hear the door. You got three Twinkies? Three Twinkies? Yeah. Sorry, it's a lot. Lastly is a banana pudding and a pint of peach cobbler. That's it, thank you. Thanks, you too. A lot of food. That was an order. <laughs> that was a king's order, dude. 
handing it out to you. Wow. Thank you. And if y'all need help, Sure, look at that. Smashburger, Smash thank you. Smashburger, thank you. Get this one. I'll get this one. Twinkies and pie, and your sides are finished with all yes, your. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank Let you us so know much. what you yeah, think. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Like I said, I could not be more impressed with the food here. All of it was really, really good. The meats, the sides, the burgers, the potatoes, the poppers. It was all really top-notch. Odessa really has something special here with Brantley Creek Barbecue. On to the school tour. I have to admit it was a little strange being just inside a high school. I mean, I haven't been inside a high school in a long time. Uh, and it was interesting. They gave us a tour of all the kind of trophy room. It's pretty sweet that a high school has a trophy room. They got the flag that they're flying over there, a bunch of different game balls, a bunch of different rings, and they explained the whole high school football tradition going back all the way to, I guess, when the school opened in probably 1959. And it's always been a big part of the community there in Odessa. That's the thing is that... There's just not that much to do out there, right? It's an oil town. It's a small town. And people, you know, are obsessed with the football there. It's awesome that they now have Brantley Creek and kind of barbecue and other stuff growing there. But football is really the cornerstone of this community. It's something that brings everybody together. And they gave us a tour of these football facilities, too. The 80s and 90s teams are really the ones that were really popular and kind of brought the school to prominence and won multiple state titles. They have a big mural in their football facilities dedicated to Friday Night Lights. And we also got to see a pep rally. This, you know, just kind of extended the bit of strangeness. I mean, the pep rally itself wasn't strange. It was just kind of weird being at a high school pep rally. But it was a lot of fun. Got really excited about the game, and it was a pretty standard pep rally. The band played, they did some skits, they introduced the team, the coach talked, and they called out each class and, you know, see who could shout the loudest or something. You know, they do it at pep rally. They just got everybody excited for the game and for the season. This was the first game of the season, so it was a really exciting thing to be a part of. After the pep rally, we went and grabbed the briskets that were heating up, and then it was game time. All good and set up here for the tailgate. We even got the hat. Got to thank Troy again for setting everything up and organizing everything. He did a great job. He does other events. Definitely go follow him on Instagram at Thanks for Eating. Just got a pretty traditional, normal tailgate set up here a cutting board, some disposable plates, a hot cooler, and a cold cooler. I got some bread. And look at these good stock briskets. Wowie. Nice crunchy bark. Beautiful. Nice and tender. And these people really liked them. No surprise there. They cooked up beautifully. Nice and fatty. Nice and tender. Just awesome product from good stock. What else could you expect from the Express himself, Nolan Ryan? There is absolutely nothing like football season and barbecue and tailgating all coming together this summer was so hot it was so brutal we were just looking forward to the weather cooling down to being busy again to having events to having football back to having everything just lifted a little bit and kind of get out of that summer rut and it was so exciting to go to odessa to kind of kick off football season busy season with my buddy troy at the Permian High School football game opener. It was pretty sweet. The stadium that they play in, Ratliff Stadium, was like the biggest one at the time. It's kind of old and outdated now, especially because there's a lot of really large high school stadiums in other towns, like much more wealthy towns in Texas than Odessa, but it was still very awesome to be there. <laughs> I'm 
You're all excited. Oh, and it's over. They can get you home. Where are you going? Hey. Oh, yeah, I told my young girl, stand in the line. I'll be there right after you. If you make it to the field house, you make it to the field house. <laughs> You're like, miss, I'm leaving. Uh, and then I thought maybe I was like, maybe I'll go. Like, all right. Catering cut right here. Yeah. Keep them all together. I, I'm on her to the house. Because I'm half, and then we are right back in here. Right I'm back like, in there. Sure. That's what it's made of. Dreams are made of right there. Good enough, Dave? Tailgate is over, we cut up all the briskets, we served a bunch of Permian Panther fans. It's time to go watch some high school football Friday Night Lights, baby. Ratliff has kind of that late 80s, early 90s industrial charm to it. Troy got us some field passes, which was pretty cool. I mean, at times I kind of felt like I was in the way, but at least we really got to see some of the football up close. And we got to see the Panthers not do very well up close uh, the Abilene Eagles really took it to the house against them and it was hard to uh, pick out of the footage to find some really good plays by Permian to select for this video the stands weren't completely full but the student section certainly was and there were definitely a lot of parents and a lot of the community out there and that's really kinda what this trip and what this video and kind of what we do is all about right it's about community it's about everything coming together everybody you know end of the week friday night having a good time eating some barbecue leaving with a smile sharing a meal together and then watching some football so glad the season is back thanks again to troy for setting up this entire trip and this tailgate thank you so much to good stock the briskets were fantastic Thanks to Permian and the staff for showing us around. Everything was really cool. Thanks again to Brantley Creek Barbecue. Fantastic spot out here. Go check it out in Odessa. Till next time. <laughs>